Joey, you don't know, maybe you know, or are you playing tomorrow night? You know? uh, I'm not positive yet. Um, if I do get the opportunity to go, I'm uh, looking forward to it and uh, just do what I can to help the team win and, um, you know, play as hard as I can and, and do the little things right. You've been sort of up and down both years since you've been here. What's that ride been like for you? Uh, you know, it's uh, it's good to see kind of the, the both teams and the, the dynamic here. And um, it's nice being able to not have to move when I do get called up and down. I think, uh, you know, it's been uh, good that I've been able to get in games with the Marlies and be around this group up here and um, kind of get to know the, the organization and all the players. And um, like I said, uh, you know, I'm looking forward to, you know, if I can get in the lineup uh, to have some fun tomorrow and uh, play with these guys. If you do play anything you learned from the game you played last season with the team that might carry over in terms of your experience there? I think just kind of, you know, I know I know the details that I, I have to play with to have success. And it's just about, um, for me, kind of playing loose and free. Like, um, I don't want to be out there gripping my stick too tight. Um, you know, I'm simple with the puck and, and things like that. So it's just making sure I'm, you know, making strong plays with it and, and not uh, not afraid to, you know, get dirty in, in corners and make sure I'm uh, strong over it. How do you think your game is improved from most of the models this year? I think, you know, especially since the start of this year, just, um, you know, retrieving pucks back and, and hanging on to them once I get it. I think, uh, you know, getting in on the four check, things like that. It's been uh, nice. I've gotten some good chemistry with a couple of guys down there and, um, you know, we've had uh, a lot of really, uh, we've compounded a lot of really good hockey games together and, um, you know, win or lose our, uh, you know, little details have been consistent throughout. So I think the, the consistency has been there. What do you think of the uh, depth of this organization? You've seen both ends of it and right in the middle of it, really. Yeah, I, no, I think it's great. I think, uh, you know, it's, it's a good problem to have when you have, you know, enough guys that you can put in the lineup that, you know, it's hard to get everybody in. Um, you know, it's... Uh, you know, it's one of those things just when you get your opportunity, make sure you're ready to go with it. And, uh, you know, whether that's playing with the Marlies or playing here, it's it's just, uh, you know, you got to you got to bring your game whenever you're on the ice. You, you waited a while for the next chance. What's the next been like for you? Uh, you know, for me, it's been a lot more away from the rink. I think um, this year's been nice. I've been spending a lot of time with my family and um it's just kind of clearing my head away from the rink. Last year was very hockey centric. I wasn't able to really get away from the game, and um, I've enjoyed being able to to do things away from the away from the arena that um, bring me joy and kind of distract me, if you will, and and I can kind of put work to the side. What kind of things are there? Uh, you know, just like I love playing games. Like I know um, my girlfriend and I play board games a lot, or like I go go bowling, do different things, like random stuff that just like. Um, you know, anything that's kind of quirky and fun. Like I said, play video games with my brother, you know, little things like that. But uh, I'm always fiddling with something. What's the bowl? Uh, bowling, arcade games, different things like that. Well, I like to golf a lot too. So like when it wasn't snowing out, I'd go golfing. <laughs> um, so we do that a couple times a week and um, just helps me clear my head and just not think about hockey. I know I, uh, I can overcook it sometimes if I just sit around thinking about hockey all day. So it's uh, it's good to be able to do some normal things in life again. Why do you think it was hard to just focus only or your only focus on hockey? Was that because everything was shut down? Was that was the only thing to distract you? Uh, yeah, a little bit. I mean, like last year, you know, obviously with the, the league's COVID rules, it was tough to, to get out and see other people. And um, being in Canada, my family wasn't able to come. I'm really close with them. And um, normally they come and see me once or twice a month. So that was tough. And um, you know, especially when I got here last year, I didn't know a whole lot of players in the organization. So I was living alone and it just, uh, it was pretty tough for me to kind of just be sitting alone all day. And um, like I said, this year's nice. My family's been out here a ton and um, it's just been great to, to get to interact with people away from the, away from the rink again. And um, I know even being around the team and, and guys away from the rink has been uh, really a blessing for me this year. Yeah, yeah, it was great. I went over to his house and we watched a couple movies, grabbed some dinner, and um, obviously he was playing. So it's just kind of his his pregame, like his day before a game routine. I know he's got a pretty tight, like kind of 24 hours where he likes to settle his body down and do different things. So, um, you know, I was just kind of there with him. And uh, it's always nice where we don't really have to talk a whole lot. We can just be with each other and, um, you know, it's just one of those things, like I said, it's just comfortable for me. And 
um, helps me take my mind off of hockey. Yeah. Oh, I mean, it was a, you know, it was a really nice gesture, I think. And, um, you know, obviously like they know, they know how tough last year was on everybody. So they're trying to help everybody out and, and make sure guys are feeling good. And, um, you know, I know as much as it helped me, I know it, it definitely probably was nice for him to see me as well. Um, you know, LA is a long way from home for us too. So, um, you know, even though we can fly there, it's not the cheapest thing for our family to go out and see him. And, um, anytime you can, can get to see each other, it's a, it's a really special thing.